The lecture was a treatise and postulated the far recent suggestions for the way forward for our great country, Nigeria, in a march to greatness again through the chain matra and through charging the graduates effectively. Ladies and gentlemen, by the end of today's ceremony, a total of 12,617 students, comprising a total of 6,900 of 4.7% undergraduates and 5,717 of 45.3% postgraduates who have successfully completed their studies will have been admitted to their various diplomas, certificates, and degrees in our 12 faculties, School of Postgraduate Studies, and Eastern Learning Institute. Out of the 6,900 undergraduates, 231 obtained distinction or are in the first class division, 231 of them. With the Faculty of Engineering topping the list with 46 first class graduating students. 1,705 passed out in the second class upper division, 2,972 are in second class lower division, 1,072 in third class. 103 with pass degree, while 517 have degrees or diplomas that are not usually classified. The record set by Mr. Yodide Dada at our last convocation ceremonies has been matched this year by two female students, Ms. Bankole Taiwo from the Department of Cell Biology and Genetics and Ms. Omotui Oyinda Mola Joke from the Department of System Engineering. Both of them graduated with perfect scores, that is, cumulative grade point average of 5.00 over 5.00. <laughs> this means that all courses taken while they are in this university, they scored A's. In particular today, we shall witness the awards of postgraduate diplomas Masters and Doctor of Philosophy degrees to the 5,717 graduating students. Out of these, 95 will receive Doctor of Philosophy degrees PhDs, while 5,420 will receive the Master's degrees, and 202 are for postgraduate diploma certificates. Today, also, three eminent Nigerians have been honored with honorary doctorate degrees. They are Israel Eminence, a large doctor. Abu Bakr Ibn Umar Gabal El Kanemi, CFR LLD, the Sheikh of Bonu, excuse me, and the seventh chancellor of this great university, who will receive the Doctor of Science Honoris Causa in Public Administration. <laughs> that renowned poet, Professor John Pepe Clark, FNAL, will receive the Doctor of Letters Honoris Causa. And Professor Ayodele Francis Ogunye, FANG, a dedicated professor of chemical engineering and philanthropist, will receive the Doctor of Science Honoris Causa in Engineering. In addition to this, Professor Osatu Frangiwa Osagi, OON, COL, will be honored with Emergency Professorship of the University of Lagos. <laughs> While four professors will become distinguished professors, and these are Professor Bagide Ibita Yoalo, <laughs> Professor Oduka Ode Amond, Professor Mrs. Cecilia Ahuma Iguilo, and Professor Jim Ijenwa Una. Ladies and gentlemen, let me use the point of this convention ceremony to highlight a few of the successes recorded in the university since our last convocation. Our members of staff and students continue to excel, making the university proud through the several grants and awards received. The University Research and Innovation Office, which coordinates internal research and link researchers within the university to relevant industry so that research Results get the appropriate end users interfaced with was able to make their mark. Small scale industrialists via the Ministry of Trade and Industry Education Centers 
Various groups of manufacturing association of Nigeria were able to be interfaced with and brought to campus for collaboratory discussions with researchers in our university. Our university is first becoming a trade center for problem solving and creative research in support of the nation's economy. The Andy Center of Excellence for Malaria Diagnosis, which is domiciled in Department of Medical Microbiology and Parasitology in our College of Medicine, was awarded the Quality of Practice Certificate after a rigorous eternal quality assurance assessment in 2016. The outcome has elevated their platform within the World Health Organization's Laboratory Quality Assurance Network, and it ranks with two existing platforms in Philippines and Cambodia, where global quality assurance malaria load testing is done. Based on this fit, our College of Medicine can now compete for more funding to escalate malaria research and development, as well as malaria diagnostic implementation activities in Nigeria and Africa. Three of our undergraduate students, Ubonia, Emmanuel Amechi, Abazwe, Mesoma Blessing, and Akinda Kolwa Shemolajide won the national essay competition on building a culture of peace through nonviolence communication in commemoration of UNESCO at 70. 500 left Kenyan students won the first prize at the 2016 General Electric University's Entrepreneurship Competition. The team was commended for their team spirit in solving business problems and are to be sponsored for internship later in the year. They are Timitokwe Osho, Uluwada Milola Oshinowo, Anselem Anoyu, Opoyemi Sumola, and Uluwa Chemilore Talabi. One of our PhD students, Ms. Fagba Yetawakalt of the Department of Cell Biology and Genetics, was chosen for the International Society for Autism Research Graduate Student Spotlight due to her research on autism spectrum disorder. She similarly won the Low Income Countries Award in 2015. The International Federation of Library Association and the American Library Association gave Dr. Mrs. Ngozi Ukachi of the University of Lagos Library Fellowship Grant and Award for Excellence. The 2016 Emerald Literacy Award for Excellence was in recognition of one of our publications with Emerald Group Publishing, which was selected as one of the awarding winning papers for the 2016 Awards of Excellence. The Head Reader Services Department, University of Lagos Library, Dr. Yetunde Zaid, became the first female librarian in Nigeria to be awarded the Fulbright African Research Scholar Grant. An emeritus professor at the Department of Chemical and Biological Engineering at the University of Wisconsin, Professor W. Amon Ray, because of his very rewarding association with his first PhD student, who is a Nigerian and one of the honorary degree awardees today, Professor Ayodile Ogunye, as well as other Nigerians he has trained and mentored, donated his library of 900 technical books covering chemistry, polymer science, mathematics, chemical engineering, automatic control and automation to the University of Lagos. The University of Lagos received three awards for its IT applications efforts. These are the NIDA plus Nihilent e-governance awards named the university as the best tertiary university in federal for 2016. The Nigeria Tanker Awards named the University of Lagos as the university with the best use of technology in federal university in 2016. And the Jonathan Kaya was also named the university website as the Federal University Websites Reporter of the Year 2016. We are happy to announce that the first batch of 19 students in our trace uh, setting BA Chinese Studies program have just returned from Suzhou University where they have spent two years in the 1 plus 2 plus 1 program. They are reported to have performed excellently and are expected to graduate at the next convocation. Your Excellencies, distinguished and gentlemen, the 2015-2016 convocation is the last in my tenure as 11th bachelor of this great university. <laughs>